Welcome to Cook, Serve, Delicious 2 and my continuing attempts to do all the Chef Bahia events at all the restaurants and get a medal each time. I'd like it to be a gold medal, but that's not always going to be possible. I'm currently concentrating on Big Burgers, E.T.'s and Chili Bowl, and I think last time around I did Shift 8 at Big's Burger and it was frantic, and there are currently no shifts at Big's Burger or E.T.'s available, so it looks like I'm going to Chili Bowl. To continue working on the shifts there. Ah, and apparently last time I was at Chili Bowl, I got a silver medal because I was terrible at the shaved ice, if memory serves me correctly which is that dish down the bottom. This time around, shift number four, it has ice cream, funnel cake, waffle cone ice cream, and pie slices. So no shaved ice for me to complete and utterly mess up. Always nice. 40% buzz, seven serving stations. I think that's orange juice as a drink. So onwards and upwards with shift number four at Chili Bowl out of a total of eight possible shifts. So. This will reach to the halfway point. I would like to get a perfect day so I could get a gold medal, especially to make up for the silver medal I got last time I was at Chili Bowl, apparently. And I can prepare in advance. One coconut meringue with coconut shavings for pie slices. And that is it. I can just prepare. pie slices, so I'll prepare two pies. Okay, cookie dough, chocolate syrup, hard candy and whipped cream. And you would like me to dip this cone in chocolate, then put some chocolate and praline in it. Whatever praline is. The downside of chili bowl is there are no sides you can use to um, make your customers more patient. So it's kind of normally kind of busy from start to finish. But it's going to get especially busy during the rush hour. So come closer to the rush hour, or the first rush hour, I think I'll prepare another pie. Without shaved ice, this is actually nowhere near as bad as the last shift I did here. Uh, okay, dip this cone and two scoops of chocolate. Mm. Right, and now, crust, mince meat, and covered. Yeah, prepare another pie. Feline, chocolate syrup, and gummy bears. A pecan. Okay, how do I do? Our, oh, it's not just orange juice. It's clean. Uh, M R. Okay, that was possibly a mistake. Syrup, gummies, and whipped cream. Uh, mint and butter pecan. Okay, I didn't realise the drink was going to be quite that involved. Do the dishes. Dip the cone. Okay, clean it. M R C O and A. Okay.
I'm getting the hang of that. Okay. okay. Nice pecan pie created. When I say created, it's on its way. Strawberry cookie bits and whipped cream. Number six, number seven, dip into pralines. Number one, dip into mint chocks. Four, six and seven are good. Five, vanilla strawberry gummies and whipped. Dip that and two scoops of chocolate. Dip that and two cookie doughs. Ah, uh, I don't know which one was next, so we'll just go with that one. Got the hang of the drinks now. Uh, number four apparently wants to be next. I think I will actually survive this. Yep, I survived it. I served 61 customers and washed 70 dishes. There's a correlation difference there. And in this restaurant, I earned $82 in salary and got nothing in tips. Miserable customers. But I got my gold medal. Miserable customers. Got my gold medal. Okay, I've unlocked backsplash number three. A wall backsplash? Backsplash, even? The generic fun times collection. Art people. Pig. Art animals. Okay, it's a guinea pig as far as I can tell, but known as Peeg. And that's it. That's all I unlocked. I thought there'd be more. Okay. Well, at the three restaurants I'm doing, the only one that's still available is Chili Bowl. So next time around... Oh, straight, it's got shaved ice again. It was going to be shift number five at Chili Bowl. Not going to be fun, but before we get to that, as always, emails. NAHPS lot 2673. Unremarkable record. Pulled from the ruins of New York State, this record of the opera, my neighborhood data analyst, received poor reviews, unsurprisingly, and ceremoniously sold a mere 12 copies in its first month of release. In an attempt to increase sales, store owners wrote NAM on the records, believing customers think the opera had a cultural significance. Okay, I'm not sure why NAM would be culturally significant, but I'm not an opera buff, so what do I know? Memo from the CEO. Mandatory fire drill. Hello, underlings. Oh, nice. This coming Wednesday, you are all required to participate in a mandatory fire drill which will help to prepare you in the event of an actual fire or other life-threatening emergency. To ensure that, that the conditions of this test are as close to the real thing as possible, the actual fire alarm will actually be pulled so the entire building will think there is an actual fire, and you will have to navigate through the horde of panicked individuals to the safety of the street below. Because it is illegal to pull a fire alarm unless it is an actual fire, I've appointed this task, I've appointed this task a certain person in the office 
who will remain anonymous for her own safety. All I can tell you is that her name rhymes with Blender, and I completely trust her to complete this task on account of my blackmailing her to do so. Remember, safety first. Robert Overling, CEO. Nice. Yeah, with my current CEO, I wouldn't put him past, it, past him to do something like that either. Missed connections. Coffee shop jitters. Okay, I think I've already seen this one, but I don't remember. I know a fellow cof a fellow caffeine addict when I see one. You were the only thing in the coffee shop that didn't appear to be rapidly shaking because your caffeine-induced convulsions were perfectly in sync with mine. My already grande heart grew to a venti at the sight of you. Now, the only thing I crave more than a hot cup of black roast is to add a few shots of you into my mix. Contact me if you want to see what our lives could be like when brewed together. Yep, definitely seen that one before. Yes, there is only a limited amount of email messages, so they do recycle after a while, and looks like that one recycled early. Okay, well that was Shift 4 at Chili Bowl, I believe. Let me check. Yep, that was Shift 4. Next time round, it's going to be Shift number 5 at Chili Bowl, unsurprisingly. As always, I hope you enjoyed or enjoyed my panic and my, oh my god, I think I'm going to fail approach to this game. And I hope to see you down the road for more Chef for Hire events in Cook, Serve, Delicious 2. Cheerio!